Thank you for coming back to the show. Thank you for doing that scary well, story thing with, me. with Bill and I. I. Do you scare easily? I, I have a feeling that you don't. Boo. No, not, no, not <laughs> scared me, but do you I get scared? Um, I feel like having older sisters, you kind of... I used to get scared a lot, and especially after, you know, that Friends episode when he talks about unagi? You know what I'm talking about? I feel like I have a pretty good unagi. <laughs> you yeah. do? Yeah. You do stuff like, don't you jump out of planes or yeah. something? Yeah. I jump out, I did Bear Grylls recently, which was so fun. Have you seen Bear, Bear Grylls? I love Bear Grylls, He's, yeah. Yeah, he came to my school actually when I was uh, nine years old, and he was one of the first people to climb Everest, youngest people to climb Everest, but I've been obsessed with him ever since, and when he asked me to do his show, I was... I just knew whatever Bear asked me to do, I had to do it. No, 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 no. I don't know what it was. No, I mean, well, that's, yeah, but yeah. no, you don't actually no, have no, to do, do everything. No, no, no. Yeah, but the funny part was, is because they usually ask, like, okay, are you, you know, are you scared of heights? Can you ride a motorcycle? Can you do this? And every time I get asked this on a job, like, can you tap dance? Can you drive a car? I'm always like, yeah, yeah, I can do everything because I always think I can learn how to. So, like, can you, can you ride a scooter? I was like, of course. Um, but I didn't know that I was going to have to, like, start myself this old Italian scooter, and that was actually the hardest part of the whole thing. It took me an hour to like get the thing going. <laughs> That's what the whole episode is. Over, you trying to start like, an oh, old Vespa? So humiliating. <laughs> God damn Vespa wouldn't go. But the funniest part was, I'm like finally getting hurtling down on this Vespa. You had to change the gears, and suddenly there was this rumbling behind me. I was like, Oh my God, I can feel him. That sounds weird. But he flew right over my head on a helicopter. I was like, God, there he is. It was awesome. Really. Yeah. And did you have to go, you had to go camping, you had to eat bugs yeah, and stuff? And yeah, I, I, you did all I ate a rat. <laughs> Cara, what are you doing? I told you I would do anything What are you doing? I would do anything You did you ate a rat? Yeah, but the worst... How could you, though? No, the worst part was, is we walking, we, we had just traversed down a hill or whatever. I yeah. think that's the word sure. that people use. Um, but I, I saw this tail sticking out thing. I was like, what's that? Is that a rat? And he was like, perfect, that's our dinner. And I was like, no. That was, that was my. It really. That it, was a tissue that fell out of my up. bag. It's not set up. It's not set up. The whole thing is. And I was like, and it had been dead for. It didn't smell that bad, but it wasn't fresh, obviously. But he was like, picked it up. He was like, you can put it in your bag because you don't have a lot of stuff. And it's like. <laughs> 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 oh my God. So annoying. Have you ever uh, lied before on uh, other stories? You saying like, yeah, yeah. We're saying like no, to get not. to get rolls. I did Victoria's Secret, and they were like, can you roll a skate? I was like, yeah, of course, it's easy. And then we were doing the rehearsals and I can't roller skate. And so I was like getting down the end and Justin Bieber was meant to be there and I was like, catch me! Because I don't know how to stop. <laughs> Justin yeah. Bieber, catch me. Yeah, but uh, uh, yeah, luckily. But then they were like, That's, but you, this, this is a risk, so we're just going to have you in walking. Uh, you do a great Irish accent in uh, Carnival Row. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you very much. That was very bad. How do you good. do that? How do you just get right into it? Are you Irish? That's actually quite good. Well, th oh, I'm, drank, I'm drunk right now. Oh, but thank you. I, I just... <laughs> me too. It's great. <laughs> Uh, and explain the, uh, can you set up Carnival Row for anyone, uh, who, who hasn't, uh, heard of it? No. Okay. Okay. Uh, uh, but <laughs> That's I mean, not it, why I'm there. it's yeah. a, so, it's a fantasy. It's a fantasy. It's a, it's a neo, it's set in this, like, neo-Victorian fantasy world. It's like this crime thriller with a, not, like, cliche Hollywood love story. It's quite this, like, twisted, heartbreaking love story. But also this, the best part, in my opinion, is this terrifying, but great, not great, but terrifying social commentary, which is what's going on in the world right now. There's so many different pieces and elements to it, but I think the most impo important thing is talking about, you know, refugees and the mi like migrant crisis right now. It's, it's really interesting uh, how it's reflecting, because to use fantasy in that kind of way, I think is the most beautiful, beautiful thing, because it just opens up the conversation, because I think the worst things that are happening in the world just need to be spoken about. So sure. if we can use art to open conversations, I think it's the best thing. Good for you. Uh, I agree. Good for us. I agree. <laughs> Uh, it's you and Orlando Bloom. Bloomy! Uh, yeah, you and Orlando Bloom, or as we know, call him Bloomy. I don't uh, know. I just did. <laughs> yeah, okay, yeah. Uh, I want to show... He'll be angry now. I, he will get mad. Like, Why would you do that? <laughs> I want to show a clip here. Uh, here's Cara Delevingne and Orlando Bloom in Carnival Row. Take a look. Bima Rusin came to me with blood on her hands. She said you died in her arms. Why did she lie to me? Because I told it. We, we told each other everything. Couldn't you have at least told me goodbye? I wanted it. I never been to hurt you. Oh, hurt me. You did. 
destroyed me. I was That's like, how you do it right there.